Lee's Logbook. Hello and welcome to the next chapter of Lee's Logbook. I am Lee and this is our Pokemon X randomized Nuzlocke. On the last episode, we got to uh, the this this spooky old Route 14. Here I am skating around in it. Um, and on this episode, we are going to a haunted house. That's what we're doing. We're going to a haunted house. A uh, quick team recap for you guys before we get in to today's shenanigans in the front of the squad. Stubborn, of course. Strength, extreme speed, rollout, and yawn. Uh, we have Lund, our War Turtle, Bite, Water Pulse, Surf King, Shield. We have Kronos, our Celebi, Leech Suit, Confusion Agent, Power Match, Relief. We have Killar and Ninkata. We have Arden, our Spiro, Fly, Fury Attack, Pursuit, and Aerial Ace. I Definitely need to train Arden. Uh, and we have Backbreaker, our Numal, Ember, Magnitude, Amnesia, and Flame Burst also needs training. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to put Backbreaker in the front of the squad because Backbreaker is the Pokemon that I want to focus on training first because honestly, if Arden is just there to be a flyer, then Arden is just there to be a flyer. But we'll, we'll see. Look what I found. It's a trainer. No, look what I found. It's a trainer. Why are you a double battle? You're not a double battle. You're just two people in one. What? Um, alright, so it's raining. Um, which weakens... Rapidash's fire-type moves, and also Numel's fire-type moves. Um, so I'm gonna send in... I'm gonna send in Lund. Ooh, ooh, can we get a Blastoise this episode? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Shh. Excuse me, Shadow Force? Do I get, do I stay in and get hit by the Shadow Force? Or do I, or, or do I do the cheeky? I think I do the cheeky play. Send in stuff. <laughs> I'm not about this. I'm not about taking damage that I don't need to take. This Shadow Force can go ahead and say hello to my normal type Pokemon this way. Whoopsie, it doesn't affect me. Doesn't affect me at all. I get free heals. I get stubborn gets free heals. See, that's that's why we do what we do every day. So I'm gonna use strength. Sunny day! Oh! Oh, bringing out the sun, are you? Bringing out the sun. Okay. Okay. Do we roll out? Do we, do we just straight up roll out right now? Fiery dance. That's cool. Fiery dance rabbitash is actually that's that's really cool. That sucks for me, but it's a cool rabbitash. That fire dance is only going to be getting stronger, just as my rollout will. So, who wins this fight? Stubborn? Stubborn? Can you kill with this? Can you kill with this rollout? Ooh. Ooh. I don't even care. I don't even care about the flame body. I don't care about none of it. I don't care about none of it. We're winning. We're winning. Backbreaker's level 21. I like it. I don't know. I don't know why. It just... It felt like a moment, so I grabbed my glasses. Alright, this burn is a problem. Um... Staraptor. Staraptor's actually terrifying. Um... Although, isn't every Pokemon I run into that the trainer has? Honestly. Let's, let's be real here. Let's be real. You mind if we be real? Uh, you know, it's a good thing that I use special attack. Would that intimidate? That, that intimidate me, actually. You know what? No, I'm gonna King Shield. Scout out what you want to do. Lower your attack by two stages, hopefully, because you're a physical attacker. I knew you are. this Staraptor set right now? Why are you physically defensive Staraptor?
Oh, oh, bring me the rain, please. I bless the rains down in Africa. All right, I... We're gonna go for King Shield again. Are you ever going to attack me? It has high special defense? Is this just... Is this wall still at there? Let's see how much Surf does now. Let's see how much this Pluck does. Minus two Pluck. Still actually does more than I thought it did. That's... That's impressive. Oh, wow! The rain just brought Surf's power to the front. Dang, man. Look how much damage that is doing. It's a four-hit KO at minus two. I mean, granted, that's still a four-hit KO at minus two, but, like, we got a Blastoise. We got a Blastoise, and that was... That was the point of all of this. Skull Bash? My guy, you don't need Skull Bash. You're a special attack. You don't need it. Keep your eyes peeled and you never know what you'll find. Thank you, two humans in one human. Oh. Oh, Lund. Lund. My guy. You're a Blastoise. I love it. I... I love and adore it. We have ourselves a Blastoise. Oh, look at him! He's a monster. A pocket monster. Alright, Lund. <clears throat> Man, if only we had that Blastoise tonight! Oh, if only we had that Blastoise tonight! Having a Mega Blastoise? Ooh. Ooh, that would have been good. That would have been good. Alright, let's heal the squad, though. Because... The squad needs help. The squad needs help. I'm pretty sure there's a Pokemon. Yep, right there. Right there. Right. Whoopsie. Right there. Okay. So uh, we're going to the haunted house. That's where we're going. Um, got ourselves a Blastoise. I'm happy about that. Kronos needs some experience to catch up with the rest of the gang. I'll take care of that. No problem. Um, but Backbreaker, of course, still needs more experience. If I can get Backbreaker to become a camera this episode as well, that'd be cool. Although I forgot, I honestly forgot what level normal evolves. I'm not gonna, not gonna lie to you. I don't, I don't remember what level you evolve, Numel. I don't remember. I don't remember to save my life. Um, alright, so... We run into wild Pokemon. Oh, it's a Chimchar. Alright. Um, we're not going to be able to run from this thing, are we? Because it's ten levels above me. Do I really want to try to fight this thing? That does ten damage. Magnitude eight. My boy Backbreaker about to take a Pokemon down that's 10 levels above it. This Chimchar trying to nasty plot and set up on Backbreaker. Backbreaker's like, nah, take this magnitude 7 in the face and get off my screen. It's probably gonna give me like 200 experience. I s it's a Chimchar, guys. It's a Chimchar. That's honestly the only reason why Backbreaker was able to do that. <laughs> Well, oh, okay. What do we got? Oh, hello? Um... <laughs> there are freaking Mewtwo's out here? I should have gone... I shouldn't have gone in the grass. The water is where it's at, my boy. Boys and girls... I cannot believe this. I... Alright. 
First things first, backbreaker. <laughs> backbreaker. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry, backbreaker, but please get out of the front of the squad. This, this is. It's too dangerous. It's much too dangerous. I. Are you. To feel shame is to be alive. In attempt to never forget that, I battle against trainers like you. Are you asking me to shame you, Butler Nash? And your semi war in the rain. You know what, Kronos? I was just talking about how you needed experience, so, uh. Magical Leaf. Of course you're a poison. Of course, of course you're a poison jab semi -port. Why? Why wouldn't you be a poison jab semi -port? All right, so you're about to go for another poison jab. I know it. I already know. So I'm gonna send in stubborn. We can hope, hopefully, take this poison jab and not get poisoned. Please don't get poisoned. Please, please, please. Game, game, game. Don't. Game. I know you want to. Joke. Don't. Thank you. Thank you. And now we use speed for the kill. Them's the brakes. Them's the brakes, my semi poor. Alright. Chronos go level 35, that's what I'm talking about. What incredible power. I feel something awakening inside me. I. Mm. Uh, this is this is where we leave. This is where we leave this individual. Oh, is he giving us an item? An old gateau. Thank you for the old gateau. Um, I have a rare candy. I should probably use it someday. Anyway, I'm gonna hyper potion Kronos. Okay, Kronos back to full health. Could have used the super potion, but it wouldn't have been full health. I'm not about that luck. Hello. I've known forever since my previous life that we would meet here today and face off. Artist Anina. Kobaleon. All right. Kobaleon. This is scary. Um, I'm gonna go for the neutral confusion. Ice Fang. Because of course you do. Because of course you know Ice Fang. Why wouldn't you know Ice Fang? Alright, at times like these, I send in Lund. Send in Lund. <clears throat> it's raining. Let's put Lund in the ra rain. Um, I mean, honestly, is there a reason to not just surf? My boy. Get off the screen. <laughs> Oh my god. That is terrifying. Ladio! Ladios! Oh. What the heck? What do I do to that? Alright, 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 alright. Alright. Okay. There's a will, there's a way. There's a will, there is a way. The psychic dragon type is in front of my face right now, which is... Wow, it's everything. Oh, wow, that does so much damage. Okay, so it's gonna confuse itself, which I'm okay with. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal because we're about to take another outrage to the face. 
hopefully, hopefully it's not a three turn. Actually, it can't even be a three turn because it goes to sleep before that. So it either gets confused this turn or goes to sleep on a two. Now that you are confused and asleep, let me attempt to put damage on you. <clears throat> let me see how much E-Speed does. Probably not a whole lot. Honestly, a little more than I expected. I'm not gonna lie to you. <clears throat> you have leftovers? This is a leftovers Latios right now? This is incredible. Incredible. Alright, I don't want this thing waking up, even though I know that it probably wakes up this turn. Does this E-Speed kill? I think barely it doesn't because of Leftovers Recovered. No, we did it! Oh, stubborn. My guy. I lost? I lost? What wizardry is this? Did you somehow rewrite the laws of causality? No, I didn't write, rewrite the laws of anything. You... You have a Cobalion and a friggin' Latios. Get the legendaries out of here. All right. Oh, oh, we got to surf. It's okay. Wait, who's in the front of the squad right now? Okay. Okay, Kronos. Okay, Kronos. You can be in. You can be in the front of the squad. It's okay. Hyper Potion. I can always use one of those. I can always use one of those. Thank you. Thank you, game. Alright, let's just, uh... Oof! Come on, this way! Oh. Oh, boy. So this is the house? It is a scary house, isn't it? Well, I guess we should go inside. What? You're going inside? Are you all serious? Sarita is off spending time with her Pokemon, so I guess we'll just have to go in without her and see if the rumor is true by ourselves. <laughs> I guess so. Let's just go inside by ourselves then. Okay. This is... I guess this is what we're doing. <clears throat> Let's get started then. It was a dark and stormy night, many years ago. Lost, I arrived at this house and went inside. The lights would not turn on, so I fearfully looked around the house. Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being there. I found the fridge, and when I opened it, a faint light. I could finally make out my surroundings, and I saw the faint outline of a man huddling in the corner of the room. I tried to tell him that I was lost, and I was hoping he'd let me stay until morning. But when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, Stay back! I apologized and continued to plead my case. Please, can't you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I looked at the man in surprise. When I did this, the man asked me, Can't you see them? Behind you. A horde of faceless men. Now then, since I told a wonderful story that will always haunt you, would you be so kind as to tip me? If you don't, you might see something really scary. You're charging us? Even haunted houses aren't free, you know. What happens if I don't tip him? Sheesh, let's get out of here. Huh? Is it over already? I wasn't really listening. Was that story you just told really true? Huh? 
<sighs> Guess it really was a scary house in a way. Well, I know you wanted to go camping, but, uh, that was kind of like camping, I guess. People usually tell scary stories by the campfire, right? I've had enough of dark places and scary things. I'd rather rehearse my dances. I'll see you later. What should I do next? I guess I'll go to LaVar City. See you later, Lee. Uh, please compare Pokedexes with me again soon. <coughs> do you do anything? Some things are best left unknown. The truth is best carried to the grave. I... Is there really no... Is there no point to this place? Pokemon Whisperer? What? What? I don't know, it doesn't like noises that are loud. No! I didn't come here to watch TV, I came here to see if anything happens, but nothing happens! So I guess we'll just have to end this episode here. We've done it! We went to this scary house and well it was a scary story and then i didn't give the guy a tip because he said i was gonna see something really scary and i didn't when i didn't give him a tip so i guess that was just a whole bunch of baloney so if you enjoyed today's episode please leave this video a like and if you want to see more and you've yet to subscribe consider subscribing and more will be sent directly to you plus you will be a part of the League. By the way, don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you don't miss a thing. Also, I have a Twitter. You can follow me if you'd like. And as always, I will see you guys next time.